Hello guys, in this video tutorial we will tell you how to add the timesheet future to your app. Now let's add the timesheet future. Go to my future section, click on view all and search the timesheet future. Click on the future to add it to your app. That is your page name. If you want you can change it as per your needs. From here you can change the feature icon. If you want you can select a solid icon or outline icon or an image from a library or upload your own custom icon. You can even upload two different images for the mobile app and website. Now let's move to the content section. If you want, you can change the timesheet name and icon from here. You can view the changes on the simulation screen. If you want, you can also delete the feature. Now click on the configure timesheet button and you'll be redirected to the app users section. Here you will see an added hourly wages column in the users tab and also a new timesheet tab in the app users section. You can set hourly wage for a new user on the register user tab or you can edit the user details to set hourly wages for the existing users. Now let's register a new user. You can register a user manually or can upload a CSV file to add multiple users at one go. Enter the name, email, phone number and set the hourly wages from here. Please note, based on the hourly wages you set here and the hours of work of the user or employee, the employee's total, total wage will be calculated. Once you have provided all the details, click on Save. Here you will see the added users and details including the set hourly wages and dates of registration. From the Action column, you can upload a file, edit user details, change status, view user details, or delete the user record. If you want, you can export the user's list into XLS or CSV format. Now click on the timesheet. Here you get insight into the time log of each employee or user. You can search the user or filter the user logs by date, week, or month. You can also select a specific date range to check the user logs. You can view the user's or employee's name, email, date, login, and logout time, total completed hours, and the total wage calculated on the basis of total hours worked and hourly wage. Please note, if the hourly wage is not set for the user, then the total wages will not be displayed here, but you can check the in time and out time. If you want, you can also export the user log by clicking on the export button. Next, click on settings and then go to timesheet settings. From here, you can select the currency code on the basis of which the wages will be calculated. Once done, click on save. Let's go back to my future section and check the language settings under language settings. You can manage all text alerts and messages showing up on the app. Now let's change the layout and color scheme of the timesheet future. Click on this color palette icon to change the page style and color scheme. Next, click on advanced style and navigation. Here you can set the page elements, color, font size, Tick mark this checkbox if you want to hide the borders. Once you're done, click on save and continue. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they are live.